what's going on? What's cooking? What's been happening? Today I'm going to do a little general reading to see what's going on for the rest of March, beginning of April. Just a little check-in to see what the cards have to say for you. Ooh, let's just get right into it, right? If you're new here, I'm Tamsie Faye. So nice to meet you. There we go. I got some dragon's blood burning here just for some strength and positivity and all that goodness. So on the card. There we go. <laughs> do a quick sweep. Let's get right to it. Eh? I'm going to do the past, present, and future. I'm going to check in with the potentials and the reasonings and then a message with the universe. So let's just see. Let's just see what the cards have to say. Okay, so this is your past energy. Ooh, the Three of Cups. Were you out partying this weekend? The world, I can see it went well. Gemini, what were you doing? And did you spend some time on yourself? Did you like have some self love time, some family time? I can see that you're having some good energy going on here. Really, really good, eh? especially the Ten of Cups with the rainbow. Ooh, what are you doing? That's good past energy there for sure. I can see that, eh? Mm hmm. Mm. You know, you were content. You felt love. You felt good about yourself. You felt good. You know, maybe you got a well rested weekend there going on. Uh huh. I can see that for sure. Well, there's no question that the past was good for you, eh? Let's just see what the present energy has to say. Wow, Gemini. Oh, the cards just the cards are taking effect. What happened? Everything was going so well. Let's just see. Hopefully the energy carries through, eh? With the present energy. You got the three of pentacles. The Emperor, the High Pretest, ooh, Gemini. Let's see, for the Three of Pentacles, I see that you've been putting a lot of work in perfection, maybe because you had such a good weekend. Now that the weekend's over, it's like, yeah, back to work, you know? <laughs> back to getting to what you need to do, eh? Maybe, you know, if you went away for a weekend or whatever, Maybe it's all about, you know, unpacking and putting things away and all that sort of thing. Um, if that's not something you were doing, like, I'm not sure what, exactly what you were doing. I just know that you had a really good weekend there. I feel like, you know, now it's like putting things back together, you know? You have to, like, put, you know, maybe put the house back together, clean up or whatever. Maybe it's just about getting yourself back to, getting back to work kind of thing, you know? Maybe it's just about getting the kids back to school. I didn't know that there was a March break there, spring break going on. Uh, <laughs> yeah, and then the Emperor. I'm feeling like yours is your present energy. Um, yeah, I feel like you're like definitely trying to put things back in order to what they were, you know? I just, I can feel that for you. <laughs> just because, you know, maybe things are so good, now you're just feeling like you need to get back to routine, back to the old, you know, getting back to what, how you, how things are now, you know, just getting back to it. I feel that energy. You know, and just because the emperor is in reverse, I'm just feeling like, you know, you're ready to set boundaries, you're ready to move forward, you're ready to put things back in order, in order to move forward. Like maybe now that you maybe now that you took some time off for yourself, that you're just able to okay, now I'm back on I'm back on track now kind of thing. Like I can do this, you know. Maybe you're just redeveloping your a new routine or a new schedule for yourself with that sort of energy is what I'm feeling. Then you have the high pretest, and I just feel like that energy is just mm, you know the high pretest. She represents. <laughs> The Shekinah, right? She's she's a uh, a goddess. She may be real. She may be not. I don't know. But she does represent that she's a spirit or a god that is with you when things are burning down. So I'm feeling like you're kind of afraid things will fall apart if you don't get back to order really quickly. Is your energy right now? You know, 
when it's feeling like you need to get really back right, right back into your routine or you need to create yourself a new routine or a new schedule or like mm, I just feel that energy is going on with you right now Gemini you feel like you might be holding back I feel like she's kind of telling you don't be afraid to say no for some reason let's just see what the future energy has or actually we should see what the potential is right let's see what the potential is for all of this you know like you're getting back on routine you're doing what you need to do mm -hmm. what's the potential eh? potential of all this energy two of pentacles huh mm, i see no i feel like um i feel like you feel disorganized like i can see you're really trying to put things back in order i feel like you're just trying to find a routine for yourself you have this energy to like reprioritize your your commitments and everything and yeah, you just, you know, as you can see, she's trying to juggle everything. I, I, I can see that for you. Like, I can see that right from the beginning. So you're really trying to get something back in order, whatever it is. Like, I don't know if it's your house or your routine or your schedule or, like, your kids' routines or whatever. I just feel like you're just trying. Your present energy is really about getting back things back in order. Cards are just having a mind of their own today. Like, what is going on? This card really wants to come out. I don't know. <laughs> this is your future energy. This one. Oh, the cards are being very specific for you today. Like, whoa. Okay. Okay. The Page of Wands here is like, you have like these big ideas. They're bigger than yourself. But I feel like your big ideas or the things that you really want to accomplish it's kind of draining out your energy, right? The fire kind of represents your energy kind of thing deal here. And I just feel like there's a lot of things you want to get done. There's a lot of things you want to accomplish. And there's a lot of things you feel like needs to be done. But it's like you don't really have the energy to complete it all kind of deal, eh? Then you have the Ten of Wands. And I'm just feeling like this is your future energy, right? So I feel like for the Ten of Wands... Um, you're working hard. I feel like you're going to be working extra hard. It's like you took time off, but then you feel guilty for doing that for some reason. I don't know why, because, you know, everyone needs some self-love, some self-care once in a while. But I feel like you should not feel guilty about it. But you do. You just want things back in order so quickly, eh? Huh. You know, I just feel like you're carrying a heavy load that you want to un unload like you know you're, you're feeling like a lot of guilt or a lot of like you feel like you should be doing more than what you're doing even though you're doing so much already you just have that inner turmoil going on within yourself that you're not doing enough but you are doing enough you know and you have the star and the star no matter which way it is the star always gives you the blessing from the universe right i feel like the star is just yeah, I feel like you're kind of going to the future. I just feel like um, you're having some negative energy just because you feel like you're not doing enough, you know? Like, I really feel that energy for you. Let's see what the reasoning for that is. Like, why do you have this, all this negativity? Like, you're doing so well. You know, like, things don't need to be 100% perfect, right? <laughs> You know, like, you know, at school, you know, my teacher gave you, it's like extremely rare to get 100%, you know? It's like, it's like, what you're doing is enough. Queen of Wands, the Queen of Wands, she's definitely telling you, you are doing enough. You are enough, you know? You definitely are doing enough. <sighs> the reasoning for this, the Queen of Wands. You know, she gives she gives you her courage. She gives you her confidence. She's loyal. She's independent. She's social. She's determined. She's giving you all of her strength. She's giving you all her abilities, right? She's giving you the strength, the confidence, the love that you need. That you're you're taking care of your cubs. See, she's the mommy there, and she takes care of her cubs. You know, I feel like that's what you're doing. You're taking care of what you need to take care of. You're on top of your responsibilities, and things are just well. 
I just feel like you need to stay focused on your end goal kind of thing, you know? Like, it's okay. Don't feel guilty. Like, I feel a lot of this turmoil within yourself is just because you're feeling guilty for taking so much time off. When you should be doing something else. I don't know what the something else is, but I'm sure you know what I mean. This card came out from your message from the universe. <laughs> the universe sees you. Look at that. You see? The universe sees you. The universe sees you for sure. See? With the eight of wands here is the man with the fiery. He keeps dancing with the fiery energy stick. So he represents that you're doing a lot of movement, you're doing a lot of focus, you have a lot of positive energy. You're on top of things, you know, he sees that. He sees you dancing with the fire, you know, you got this, you got this, you're doing great. For sure, you know, you got a lot of movement, you're going fast pace, you know. There's a lot of action, attraction, you know, air is traveling quickly, you know. We got this, we got this for sure. Then for the Eight of Cups, you know, <laughs> you have so much love. Your cup is so full of love. You know, you're doing good. Things are content. Like, everybody in your family is content. Everybody is happy. Everything you got going on around you is good. You know, all is good. Whatever anger you had within yourself is just going to be, you're just going to overcome it. You know, it's just going to pass as quickly as it came. The Five of Swords, I feel like you're just getting things back together, you know? I feel like you felt like you were run down, but I feel like things are picking up and things are going to get back on track and the universe is seeing that for you, you know? Like if it was the other way around, it would be a lot of turmoil, a lot of destruction, all that kind of thing. But because it's reversed, it's kind of like, you know, you're getting back on track. You're getting yourself back together. You're doing all of these things that you need to do, you know? Mm-hmm. The universe definitely sees that for you. So that's, that's, that's like looking good. Like, I don't see you. Like, you're, you're on track there. Just be easy on yourself, you know? Be, be soft on yourself. Thank you for stopping by. It's so nice to see you. i love for you to join my channel if you haven't already and subscribe. Or, you know, send a message if this resonated with you at all in any way. But yeah, I do live streams every Tuesday, so check them out. <laughs> and you can ask questions or, you know, whatever you want. We just talk. And I'll see you next time. Bye.